Hardware, how does it all work? The hardware is the part of the computer you can touch and can see. For example, your keyboard, your mouse, or your monitor. The computer has a central processing unit, or CPU. Everything plugs into the computer, similar to a home entertainment center. This is the heart of the system. It contains all the parts that make the computer work. If something is not working, check to see if it is plugged into the computer and outlet correctly. The computer also has many slots for connecting other devices, such as computer disks, flash drives, etc. Turn the computer off and then on again. Check to see where the power cord is for the computer. The monitor. The display screen similar to a television. Turn your monitor off and then on again. Check to see which plugs are from the monitor and where they are plugged in. The keyboard. Used for typing. Turn your num lock key off and then on again. If this light does not turn on or off, it usually means your computer is frozen and needs to be restarted. Check the plugs coming from the keyboard to see where they are plugged in. A mouse. A small handheld device that attaches to the computer. It may have two or three buttons. The mouse is used to move the cursor or pointer on the computer screen. Unplug the mouse while the computer is on. See the light under it turn off. When you plug it back in, you may need to restart the computer for it to work properly. The mouse keys. A left click is clicking the button while the pointer is over something on the screen and it will select it. Right clicking, clicking the right button while the pointer is over something on the screen will bring up a menu of options. This menu lists things that can be done with that ob object. Example, a copy and paste. Double clicking. Double clicking means click, clicking twice with your left mouse button very fast. This is used to begin programs. Dragging. Holding down the mouse button while over an object will grab onto it. If you move the mouse while holding down the mouse button, you will be able to move or drag the object to a new place on the screen. Dropping after dragging an item, releasing the mouse button will leave or drop the object in a new place on the screen. CD-ROM or DVD. Very similar to stereo CD players, it not only plays music but can also retrieve information stored on CDs. Most current computers have rewritable DVD drives, meaning you can create or burn things onto DVDs or CDs. USB flash drive. This looks like a plastic tube that can be inserted into a slot in the computer. These disks hold information that can be used to store or exchange information between computers. You should always use both the computer and the external device like a flash drive to save important information in more than one place. No important terms? Check your computer and label the parts.